I was sitting on a bench in a dance school, waiting for the unknown. Then she walked through the door, a lovely young lady, shy but confident, with the most beautiful eyes I'd ever seen. She sat at the table next to the window to change her shoes. I could say you her. She glanced and smiled. Then she walked toward me. We met on the dance floor. When the sad music came on, we melted in each other's arms and we started to dance. Her height was ideal and her hug was very soothing. She held onto me tightly for more than an hour. Even during the Cortina's slow songs, she won't let go and I was able to close my eyes during some parts of the melodies. The gods were so kind to me. Our embrace was so intense, it almost felt like we were falling in love. The others gave us looks. They couldn't believe it. How could two people dance that passionately for so long without changing partners? Some even got mad, but we didn't care. She was unique in how she moved, felt, the way she expressed her feelings. She was telling me about her life without saying a single word. After the milonga finished, she approached me and said, Thank you. I enjoyed every song we danced and walked out of the door into the night, just like that, like nothing happened, as if we never danced. Suddenly, it all came to an end. I felt utterly devastated. The girl with the beautiful eyes is gone. My longing for her embrace lasted in my head until the next morning. Her soft face would not leave my mind. The sensation was like a shot of morphine and its effect is slowly fading away. The girl with the beautiful eyes prefers to remain mysterious. She has her own reasons, I suppose. But for now, I need to get my fix again. Perhaps I should go to a different milonga the next week and dance with someone new that can make me forget about all of this. In the following days, she posted a smiling selfie on her page from her vacation and while she sat by the ocean alone watching the sunset, I sat alone at home stoned. Thank you.